Hello, my name is Steve Knudsen. I'm the Outside Plant Product Manager here at Clearfield. And we're here today to talk about our Field Smart Outdoor Product Cabinets. Uh, the ones we have in front of us today are the Pond Offering. We also have a very similar uh, product with a cross-connect application. Basically, we're changing up the bulkheads. But the two sides we've had up till now have been the 576 or the 288 cabinet. Uh, this one can also be uh, stacked so you get 1152 on there as well. But again, they have all of the pond features, uh, splitter applications, cable routing, um, designation. But we're here today to talk about the 432 cabinet. Let's take a closer look at that. We're here today to talk about the new 432 Field Smart cabinet. Um, much like the 576 and 288, um, you and the customers came back to us and said, you know, we need a little larger cabinet, uh, one that's uh, capable of being mounted on either a pole or a pedestal or a pad. And so we've come up with this, this product itself. And so you can see that very, very close in size and shape to the other ones, a little bit taller to accommodate the additional ports on the inside. As part of all of our Field Smart products, um, the, the heart and soul of it is our Clearview cassette, which basically is a standalone 12 port. Um, building block that we can go through and grow incrementally in multiples of 12. Let's take a closer look at that. Our new 432 cabinet, much like the other ones, is made out of a heavy duty gauge aluminum with powder coat paint on there to withstand all the, the different environments um, from the, you know, the weathers in Minnesota down to Arizona. Um, it is a NEMA 4 rated cabinet. And we achieve that by grommeting on the outside and on the back side we can see some seal cons which we'll show you as we turn the cabinet around. The inside of the cabinet itself has got feeder and distribution ports on here. This cabinet along with everything else has for each bulkhead has four different feeder um, cassettes which gives you 48 feeder cassettes on this one. And we've got 432 distribution points on here. If you look on the inside we've got cable routing cable management on top and bottom. We have a nice distribution tray in the back here for slack management. And then on the right hand side we've got a spot here for 13 of our splitter modules that go in here. And basically it's a 1 by 32 splitter. We've got cable running that come up. We've got two different parking lots up here. Um, so as the customers can be come up and, and service needs to be turned up, very easy to go back in, take one of these the, your jumpers, route it around, and plug it in place. Um, cable routing diagrams on the bottom and also on the side over here to show the exact routing location for all your fibers. In addition, on the doors, we've got designation cards and labels um, for circuit management. Um, another nice feature here on this, we've also got each of the individual cassettes labeled as well. Let's take a look at the back side of the cabinet. Looking at the rear of the cabinet, again, we have the, uh, the same doors on the front with our grommet on the, the exterior edge. And the back you can see is all dressed up very nicely, which we do at the factory, or you can also pre-terminate or do it yourself in the field. This particular one has six cable entrance ports at the bottom. We talked about the seal cons earlier. Um, we come in here from our bottom uh, with the seal cons. And on this application, you can also go through and do a mid-span. So say you've got a 96 port fiber, you want to drop off 24. We can come in here with the mid-span, take your jacketing off, drop off 24, and then continue on with the rest of your fibers. In regard to mounting options, the 288 and 432 have brackets on the side where they can be pole mounted. Um, in addition, all three different cabinets can either be pad mounted or mounted um, on a vault. And we've got different vault applications for all three different sizes. Um, again, let's go turn around and take a look at the front of the cabinet. Again, as you can see by the front, this cabinet is designed for pond mount applications. Um, you can deploy these things anywhere within your network uh, for access points, uh, termination drops, uh, mux, demux applications, uh, anywhere within network architecture. Uh, things like cell backhaul or um, uh, like a fiber hub collapse, we have a very similar cabinet to that. But basically, anywhere you want to have access outside of your head end or central office, these cabinets will define that. Again, just to reiterate, as with all of our Field Smart cabinets, as well as the Field Smart frames, panels, wall boxes, whatever, the primary building block is the, is the, the cassette. Scalable in increments of 12, it allows you to uh, maintain your subscriber revenue with your investments to maximize those investments and grow as you need to. Again, Clearfield has a cabinet to meet your need, whether it's the 432 cabinet, the 288 cabinet, the 576, or the maximum density 1152.
Clearfield has got a, a product designed to meet your needs. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact your Clearfield representative or check us out on www.clearfieldconnections.com. My name is Steve Knudsen and have a great day.